Hi, this is Brian with Mr. Rudder Plumbing doing a sewer scope at 6311 Northeast 94th Avenue in Vancouver, 98662. Uh, point of access, I believe this is the access point. It's back by the uh, back slider door. There's a piano here. It was uh, covered up with a paver stone. Uh, looks like we have a two way clean out here, so we're going to be heading downstream. I'm currently waiting. Uh, currently waiting for a access code to run some water, um, so we're going to zero the footage meter out and proceed out towards the main. Okay, so it uh, looks like we are in 4 inch ABS pipe. And this house is vacant, so there could be a lot of debris build up. So, what we're going to do is just get the camera out as far as we can go and then evaluate the pipe on the way back. So right here, it looks like the bottom of the pipe is potentially gone. So that could be grease buildup that's looking like the pipe, the pipe is gone. Okay, so here at the 98, 99 foot mark, looks like we're dropping into a bigger pipe. We're gonna pause and locate this. Okay, so located this in the uh, gravel driveway at three feet, 10 inches deep. So it looks like we're still on four inch UBS. Got some debris built up on my lens here. Not sure if that line that we're dropping into is a private main or a main that's running up and down the driveway, but because of the drop into T connection, I'm not going to be able to go any farther than where that mark is under the driveway here. So, so it looks like we do have some standing water in multiple areas of this run here. I do have a riser on my camera to elevate it up out of the water, so we're gonna mark this point. Okay, I've located this 10 feet obviously from the main, <clears throat> three feet deep. And this is where there's that standing water. You can see because of the grease buildup, there's another clean out access point. That's our test tee. So this is where it comes out of water, so we're going to poke, uh, pause and uh, locate this mark here. Okay, I've located that point uh, 2 feet 11 inches deep. So there's another area of standing water. So this is Schedule 20 ABS pipe, so this stuff is pretty brittle. It almost looks like the bottom of the pipe is, uh, is gone. Another area of, of standing water. So another area of standing water. Large amount of grease build up.
standing water there. You can see it's back flushing towards my camera. All these little bellies are just really small. They're only like five to ten feet long, but in combination with multiple bellies, this could be an issue with the sewer line. underneath of the concrete patio. So this is where it's making a turn coming back towards the clean out. So a couple of areas of minor grading issues. Um, this is a two-way clean out so we're going to turn the run the camera in towards the house. See how far we can get up in the line. Camera slipped on itself. issue with getting my camera to go up the line there so I'm going to risk breaking my camera. So from the point of access out to the city sewer main, I believe it's a city sewer main. It could be a private main uh, because of the connection point being 90 down into a T connection. I'm not going to be able to advance my camera past that point. Um, because of the multiple bellies in the line from the point of access to the connection point at three feet ten inches deep um, we're gonna have to fail the sewer inspection recommend a line replacement from the clean out right outside the house uh, to the uh, private main or main line in the gravel driveway thank you